I don't think so, not at all, no. So it was in fact a time, about 14 years ago, after the end of the Cold War, when people thought that the nuclear issue can be taken off the agenda because there's been an agreement, the, the, the polarization of the world due to the existence of two ideologies so hostile to each other came to an end with the ending the Soviet Union. Therefore, people thought, well, this was the main issue which, which divided people. Therefore, we can take off the agenda. But then I'm afraid that the last few years, the situation became much more dangerous. Right. To some extent, it may be saber-rattling, but I'm afraid it is, it is real. Danger is real. Because what, what, has, what Bush is saying, he says that despite the non-proliferation treaty under which all nuclear powers undertook to get rid of their weapons, he looks at weapons of being needed perpetually. They are needed for our, for our security. And if a nation like the United States, the mightiest nation militarily and economically, if the United States feels that it needs nuclear weapons for its security, then how can you deny such security to nations who really are threatened, who feel themselves threatened. And therefore the result is of this policy will be a proliferation of nuclear weapons.